joining me this evening. I have something really special in offer. I'm going to the Karen's themed diner just outside Grand Central. Central, I think it's station. So here we are, walking in, trying to follow the old uh, phone there. I think we're heading this way. Anyways, so we'll get you closer. We'll turn it back on. In the Central Station, they have this big bowl right in uh, Birmingham's Bowl. So I could have missed that if I didn't come here. So we're inside like, uh, I think it's a subway. So I'm just gonna try to find the, the Karen's theme restaurant at Karen's Diner. It should be around here somewhere. So it should be close. So we're inside like a mall. I think we're close, I don't know. We'll take a look at uh, the sign and see if it says anything. Karen's Diner 2, level 2, 293. Two, so where am I? You're here. 293. So, I think if we just go this way, we should be able to find it. Ah, there we go. I see it. Great food, terrible service. Karen's Diner. Alrighty. There's beside Kitty Cat Cafe. I wonder what that is. Hello. Same thing. Entrance this way. Okay, so what time is it now? It's half five, so I have half an hour to kill. Can we go inside there? So let's take a... Let's take a... See how that goes. You're not into getting abused by uh, by servers and that. You always have the uh, Kitty Cafe, which is located right next door to it. So you can have coffee or tea and uh, have cats all around. See, look at the little cat sitting there. So it's another option if you don't want to be abused verbally. You can uh, have kitties all around you while you're enjoying your snacks. So I'm going to wait till closer to time because I don't want to be really abused because uh, my appointment's for six and it's about half five. So I'll, I'll walk around the shop and I'll just at my own leisure and we'll see you closer to the six o'clock. Okay, so here I am. It's 10 minutes ahead of time. So I don't know if I should go in earlier or not. I, it doesn't look too busy, so we'll see. But I um, don't know what to expect, so let's give it a shot. Now there is music in the background, so I'll probably have to cut some of that out. I have an appointment for a pick. Yeah. Now I am hungry, so hopefully the food's good. I know the service is supposed to be terrible, so everyone's wearing hats. See around it. I guess it would be cool to work here that you don't have to actually be good with anyone and just do your job, so that'd be interesting. Let me know your thoughts on if you would come to the restaurant if you were in town in uh, Birmingham City. It's located right in the central station on the uh, first floor upstairs, the ladder is there.
It would be a festive uh, environment, a lot of noise. Six p.m. She looks like she really enjoys her job. So, t-shirts are $14.99, hoodies are $39.99, and then tote bags, what? $8.99. This doesn't mention the uh, apron. There you go, you got this. Michael, feel it. I'm on my own. No one wants me. No allergies. Alright. Alrighty, so. Let's sit here. We're going. Having fun yet? Yeah, come on. Take off my other hat and we'll find me if we wear a new one. Alright, so. Here's the menu. There you go. They're talking about me. No! <laughs> so they're having some pack on uh, my expense. So here we go. Take a look at the big the menu. Now the signs are no vegans, but there's actually a vegan option on there. There's uh, this one here and also a vegan meat patty. I think I won't uh, attempt my fate with that. I'm actually quite hungry, so uh, probably gonna be looking at uh, I will get the, uh, I want to see the manager one. So basically it's uh, two British uh, beef patties topped with cheese, streaky bacon, lettuce, tomatoes, and sauce, and for drinks. Oh yeah, you can have add-ons, I guess you have to add on your, uh, your chips. All burgers are served with a bun and a heap of french fries. Okay, no. The french fries are included. Um, and there's more in the back. Other shakes. Cocktails. What else do we have? We'll wait and see when something happens there. Like I said, a lot of this will have to be uh, cut out because of the music. So I'll, we'll keep all the good bits when they're giving us abuse. Are you taking your fucking piss? Yes. Are you cracking your fucking tail? Yeah. You sad. What the fuck is going on here? Jesus. A magic of nut to a die that you start to plug yourself. What happens if I make up some fried with you? That's it, you're gonna help me. Yeah, help you. You're helping me. No, I'm not. I don't think fucking at the moment. You look like fucking plastic lord. What? <laughs> Let's get equal that go. Yeah, yeah, you got that go. There we go. Whoa! Wait! Santa, does she have a naughty list? Yes. Yeah, I've been waiting for a fucking time. Shut the fuck up, Harry Potter. Can you fuck yourself over there? Go on, bring some over, will ya? Huh? Bring 
reaching over. Pop up, did you sound good? Let's see what you do. Shut up! What did you put up? Oh. But you're on the nice list, so you haven't been doing a good job. Huh? You're on the nice list. So you I'm on the nice list. You're on the nice list. Why am I on the nice list for? For Santa. To be honest, probably have a naughty list because I don't want you coming into my fucking house. Not looking like that. What happened to your camera? Why is it off? It's on. It's just oh, on. It's on. Yeah. It's the same. Oh, yeah. 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 What's, what's your YouTube name? Celtic Mick Walks. Celtic Mick Walks. Why? Because I walk and I'm Celtic and my name's Mick. <laughs> Where do you walk to? Everywhere. Just came back from Nepal. I was, uh, in, the, I was in Nepal for over a month. Where's she at? It's in Asia, near China. I don't care. Go ahead, um, why you having granddads? I'll have, I uh, want to see the manager. Yeah, are you looking at him? What's yeah. wrong? That's it. You sure? Positive. What else? I'll have uh, a Madri. Manager, Madri. That's it. Are you an alcoholic? No. Oh. <laughs> Alright, what do you try is well, bitch? So far, it's similar to what I expected, but a little bit different. I don't know what I was expecting, but uh, um, they throw the menus at you, and they able really to give you a card code just to abuse you for the whole time. So I guess it would be fun if you're working here. Um, people are around eating the foods and that, so see what the food's like. Um, the prices are not too bad there, like I said. Uh, the uh, want to see the manager is $18.95 and then the beer is uh, $4.95. So we'll see what it's like. There seems to be a good crowd at the door, like they keep filing in there, so there is a good turnover. So if you have to come in there, you have to book in advance. So make sure you do uh, check their website. Um, there is no case, it's all over. Um, predominantly in the UK. Corona. Corona. Actually, I said Madri, but they don't have it. So. They put the wine in for you, so. What are these buckets for? Just so I got them traveling. So I have to serve myself apparently. So go up and get. It. He's too busy playing on his laptop. There, so. there you go. What the fuck are you doing? Hey, give me that shit back. There we go. I'm taking my bit. There. So you have to help yourself there. So. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see what this is like. It's getting a little warm, so we'll take a look. So here's the uh, the chips. They look fine. And the burger. In fairness, it actually looks pretty good. So we'll take a little uh, sample of this and let you know what it tastes like. Chips first. They're actually very good. That's a pretty big bait. That's a pretty big uh, burger. Look at the size of it. It's a uh, really, really big. Mm. Enjoy that burger, sir. 
Very good. Although they didn't give you any napkins, so. <laughs> They're massive though. Luckily, I came prepared. I brought my own uh, napkins. I have some here. Be prepared. What's a boy scout? These are absolutely massive. Hard to actually eat. And the bun's breaking up. I didn't do something else special happens. left over but very good the burger was really really good very thick hard to eat actually you had to split it into two sandwiches really good and the beers here so I'd highly rate the food not too bad just finish off the beer and we'll see what it's like to get the uh, get the check <laughs> I'm uh, having a vlog of uh, my experience at uh, Paris Diner. Just to show the world what kind of place it is. I bet you they will. I bet you they're fucking <laughs> Insurance. 
Where are you from? Ireland. What are you doing now? What are you doing now? Visiting uh, Birmingham. What's your opinion of it so far? Nice. Nice? Yeah. Better than I expected. How long have you been there? Uh, Friday, uh, Friday morning. I'll, I'll, I'll be here for another couple of days. Well, what have you done since you've been here? Uh, went to the Christmas market, the hostel, I Centenary Square, Victoria Square, the Ferris wheel. And then, of course, Karen's Diner. Our next hostel. Everybody, this kid here shakes himself as he has my. For Christmas. Yeah. What do you want for Christmas? Oh, oh. A new missus, by the way. <laughs> a new missus. It out. Yeah. Santa, he wants a new missus, so buy him a buffalo sitting. And what do you want for Christmas? A new boyfriend. Yeah. A new boyfriend. And she wants to stop being the side bitch in every relationship she's had. Okay. Can you do that, Santa? I can do that. Okay. Look at Santa, look, there's his little elf over there. Happy Lady Gaga Happy 
diner experience I don't know how I'm going to edit it and show because there's a lot of copyrighted music in that but uh, we'll do the best there was a lot of good crack great food uh, well worth your while if you're ever in uh, Birmingham to stop by uh, Karen's diner it was the food was really 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 good surprisingly uh, so you're looking at I think it cost me $28.95 with the beer and uh, the, the double burger with the bacon and the chips the chips were very good it was a garlic type chips but so if you're in uh, Birmingham, make sure you stop on by. It's right into the Grand Central, uh, the mall and the station, and then right beside the uh, Kitty Cafe. So that'll be me for tonight. Uh, tomorrow I have another full day. Um, plus we're gonna head up going to Chinatown and see, see what else we get up to tomorrow. Signing off. Have a good evening.